morning, good evening, good afternoon, good whatever, whenever you're watching this. Welcome to the Greg Troxel Show. Now another time of tasting cereal. If you haven't seen the other episodes, go back, check the other ones too, man, because all we're doing right now is tasting a bunch of different cereals. If you haven't heard the backstory, when I was a kid, my mom and I would go grocery shopping, and when every time we saw brand new cereal or brand new cookies or brand new something, we had to get it. We boom, throw it right into the basket. Boom, throw it into the basket and always picked up new stuff. A lot of it fell into the trash. But yo, we tried it, man. Oreo, cereal, um, Chips Ahoy cookies and all these different things. So as I go through the grocery store now today, Walmart, Kroger, Publix, shout out to you all. You never know what you're going to see. So the other day I'm walking through the Walmart, man, and I see this one. From Kellogg's, a new take on a classic, Strawberry Krispies. So see, I grew up on Rice Krispies, and a lot of times my mom or my dad would not get the frosted Rice Krispies. They would get the regular Rice Krispies. So we'd put that in the bowl and be like, man, this stuff is bland, dude. It's like, what is this? So we go over to the sugar where my dad had the sugar for, the, for his coffee. Boom, pop a little sugar, pop it on top. Frosted Krispies, baby. That's what I'm talking about. We had to make do with what we had. But now they're going to come out with some Strawberry Krispies? Yo, you know I had to try it. A little bit of snap, a little bit of crackle, a little bit of pop. So let's see what this is going to be like, man. On the front, it says colors and, and flavors from natural sources. A natural source could be all kinds of stuff. So a lot of people say, oh, it's all natural. Oh, yeah, sure, I'm sure it's vegan too. But it doesn't matter. Natural source how can it be bad for you, right? All right, let's check this out, man. Um, just checking out the back. A little game. You know, back in the day, cereals used to come with toys and stuff in it. Now they don't come with jack crap. Stuff like this on the back. It don't go on cheap on us, y'all. All right, let's check this thing out. I didn't pre-open this one. It's all good. We're going to open it. And one day, I'm going to figure out why can't people, see I can't open the stupid thing. These bags, these bags suck. You know that they never seal back and I'm thinking they don't want you to keep it fresh because if longer it sits there and it doesn't go, it goes bad, you got to go to the store and buy more. You know what I mean? All right, let's pop this bad boy open. You know you got to do the smell test. Yo, it smells like uh, strawberry, smell it. Don't it? It smells just like strawberries, don't it? Yeah. You couldn't smell that? Oh, what's wrong with you? You might have a little cold or something. All right, let's pour some in. It's a nice pink flavor. A little pink, uh, a little pinked. All right, it's all good. That's what it looks like. <laughs> Whatever. All right, so we're going to pop the milk in there and see if we can hear some snap, crackling, and popping. It's going. Can you hear it? I don't know if you can hear it or not. They talking. I think they said, yo, you need to try the Strawberry Krispies. I think that's what they just said. Oh, the milk just turned turn pink. Not too sweet. I honestly could use some more sweetener. Put a little frosting on top. I don't know if they have a whole lot of flavor to them. The milk turns strawberry quick. Like real quick. Like I don't know if you can see that. Y'all, let's see. See that right there? I don't think you can. But if you can, great. If you can't, nah, take my word for it. The milk turns strawberry quick. I think it even said that on the box. Maybe not. Maybe I've lost my mind. It's all good. So let me take one more bite. Now they sit there for a second. Not bad. Kind of like just rice griffies with a little strawberry taste. But really, I don't taste it off the cereal as much as I taste it off the milk. 
and the milk turns strawberry milk. I mean, maybe it's just all draining off. I don't know. Anyway, that's kind of our taste test today on Strawberry Krispies. That one. Um, new feature we're going to figure out, you know, instead of the, the star ratings or the G ratings or whatever. Do we keep it or do we can it? And, I mean, it's not bad. It's not the best thing in the world, but it's kind of like it's Rice Krispies. And honestly, Rice Krispies ain't all that great. Um, I'll say we keep it, you know, just for, just in case. But I'm not sure that it would be on my regular rotation of cereals. It may be on, you know, every once in a while. Hey, yo, go check this out. Kind of like Captain Crunch or something like that. Can't eat it all the time, but it's not bad, man. It's pretty good. Got soggy really quick, that's for sure. But I guess Rice Krispies do that really quick. I mean, I'm talking real quick, y'all. That's some sog cereal. Anyway, it's all good. Hope you enjoyed this little episode. Go down there on the bottom. Hit like. Hit share it. Hit it up on your Twitter. Throw it on your Facebook. And make sure you subscribe to this channel, y'all. Hope you like the NWA 70th anniversary show. I am a huge wrestling fan, if you didn't know that. National Wrestling Alliance coming back strong. Billy Corgan doing his thing. Yes, the Smashing Pumpkins dude. Billy Corgan. He owns the NWA now. Anyway, check this out. Um, come back. You never know what you're going to see here on the channel. It's not always going to be cereal. It may not always be food. It's going to be places and things and all kinds of stuff, man. Peace. Y'all have a good day. See you on the flip side.